What's up, guys? Welcome back to PJ Pop Culture and All Seas Collectibles. We are back with a brand new Hot 6 this week. Before we get started, just a quick reminder again, guys, July 27th, go to the All Seas Fan Expo, check out their sports cards collectibles. They're going to have Mark Jackson from the Denver Broncos in, $10 autographs. You cannot beat it, guys. Come check them out. Also remember here at All Seas Collectibles, get your hold slots. You get 20% off books 10 percent off supplies and you're going to get the books you want each week so without further ado let's do this let's do this you ever had a dream that 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 you you what you can do you skip you don't you skip you want to know you skip you can you you what you can do you skip you don't you do skip you don't you skip you want to know all right beard what do you got for us this week First up, we got a new book called Reaver. This is from Image Comics, written by Justin Jordan and Rebecca Isaac on art. All right. Looks like a new fantasy type uh, sword and sorcery type thing. Okay. Looks really good. Image is really good at these type of things. So. Yeah, I got that. I'm looking forward to reading it. It looks really good. I got that uh, Saxon type makeup. Yeah. 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 It looks. It looks awesome. Very cool. Next up, we have a new series based on a popular game from Critical Role. A lot of you guys might be familiar with Critical Role for their gaming podcasts and all that other stuff. Mm -hmm. But this is a new book called Vox Machina Origins. Very cool. This is their second series with Vox Machina. The first one was really popular. Right. Yeah, I'm, when I got here, I asked Chris if that was Kratos, and he quickly corrected me. <laughs> he kind of looks like Kratos, but no. A little bit, but yeah. uh, very cool. And this is Dark Horse. Like Dark Horse, yep. Dark Horse is putting this out. It's from that cr Critical Role guys. Like some of you guys, if you're gamers, you might know who they are from their podcasts and stuff. Right on, right on. Vox Machina. Vox Machina Origins. Awesome, awesome. Next up. We have a new book from DC called Batman Universe from Brian Michael Bendis. It's his first crack at Batman. So Bendis with Batman. Yeah, okay. this is going to be a new mini series. So That's cool. his first crack at Batman so we can see how he does it. Yeah, hopefully. Because rumor has it he might take over Batman when Tom King's done. Really? So it'll be interesting to see what his takes gonna, how he can write the Dark Knight. Is that just like a pile of villains underneath? It looks like a pile of villains he beat up and is standing on top of him triumphantly. <laughs> That's cool. Looks like he's stepping on the Riddler or something like that. Yeah. Because the, there's the, the Riddler's cane. cane. Yeah. Heck yeah. Definitely looking forward to this. See how Bendis does with the DC universe. Cool, man. Next up is another new independent book from Absolute Comics Group called Amp. I really like this book. Just, just from the look of the cover right? it's got a really cool cover yeah. it's another superhero type story but like everybody in this family or group are all like handicapped and yeah. they have they get their superpower somehow so we gotta read it to find out it just looks fun that does look super fun and i like that you know being a physical therapist i like that uh the physically, you know, yeah. handicapped are getting a shot at comics. Though. Yeah, it's it awesome. looks fun. It's, yeah. it's always good to see them try new things. So. Absolutely. Very good pick. Nice. This next book has been delayed a little bit because it caused a little bit of controversy when it first was announced and offered. It's a book called Second Coming mm -hmm. from Ahoy Comics. And <laughs> this book looks kind of funny. I was flipping through it earlier. I can't wait to read the whole thing. But uh, the guy in the costume is kind of like, this universe is Superman. He's like at the powers of a god and all that other stuff. And he's like a good role model for people and everything. And then one night after an accident where he couldn't save a bunch of people, God comes to him and says, Hey, hey, you're a good role model. You do that. I need you to take care of uh, Jesus and show him the ropes and show him how to be a good guy. So he basically, Jesus becomes his roommate and he teaches him how to be good and it uh, slipping through it is pretty funny yeah um you know i know some people might think it's blasphemous but it is pretty funny so yeah, you know i i could see why yeah it cause a little controversial. yeah a little controversial yeah. but it looks good i uh, can't wait to read it you know just based off of this it, it looks tasteful yeah, yeah. not i slipping through top. it it's done pretty good it doesn't really pick one side or the other you know so it's it looks good. They, they finally got it out, and I can't read it. You should check it out. Yeah. For this week, we got a new one shot from Marvel. Two of their favorite characters battling it out Wolverine versus Blade. Oh. The man. Vampire Hunter. So I'm not sure why they're fighting each other, but it's a nice one shot, and it's Blade versus Wolverine. How can you go wrong? Yeah, that's an absolute win for any Marvel. Yeah. Man. 
I guess they figure since neither one of them been around for a while, we'll just throw them and fight each other. So yeah. Who, who's that guy in the back? Do you think? Uh, I don't know. It looks like some kind of weird, evil vampire lord that they uh, got to fight. It's Dracula. Yeah. <laughs> awesome, man. Let's. But let's, it's a great combo. Yeah, I mean, obviously, we know who's gonna win this one. I'm just kidding. I have no idea. They'll Read fight the for a while. They'll have a draw. They'll yeah. have a few beers and be like, yeah, hey, start yeah. partying, you know, because that's usually how Wolverine's fights end up, you know, when he's fighting heroes. Have a cigar and yep. shake hands. Yep. <laughs> awesome, man. Let's roll them out and show the folks what they get to look forward to this week. And again, guys, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Each week, we just kind of show you what we're thinking is going to be hot, what to look for. There's so many more books to choose from. Go to your local shops. Definitely come to All Seas. Pick up your books. And we'll uh, see you guys next time here on the Hot Six. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Hot Six. Want to do a quick announcement here. This week, starting this week, we're going to do a weekly giveaway. Every week where we pick a winner, you get a free comic book sent out to you. Uh, and we're going to choose one of the ones from the Hot Six. This week, we're picking Blade versus the Wolverine or Wolverine versus Blade. So all you got to do to enter into this free giveaway like the video and comment your favorite Marvel character next week, or excuse me, not next week, because next week we have off, but the following week, we're going to pick a winner during the video, ship it out to you, and all you got to do is enjoy. So we'll catch you guys next time here on the Hot Six. Bye. <laughs> Shit.